In this video, we're going to take a look at how Dallas-based Ziosk was able to raise over $100 million back in 2015 when they rolled out tablets to Red Robin and Olive Garden. Okay? Ziosk is a very similar pay at the table to Tabby. Tabby uses QR codes on every single table to enable the same experience as you have with Ziosk. The difference being with Tabby, you don't have any hardware costs, it's simply the software costs that works on QR codes. Okay? So let's take a look at the money. Clearly there must have been money that, that Olive Garden and Red Robin got back. They're publicly traded companies, and if they spend millions of dollars on a technology like pay at the table, they better have a return, but they gotta show us where that return is. Okay, so let's take a look at a few articles. First, the Dallas Business Journal. It says in this article, Dallas-based Zios raised $100 million in September, this is back in 2015, to support the Olive Garden rollouts as well as others across different brands. In October, the company completed the installation of tablets across 500 Red Robin locations. Now let's take a look at an article that talks about Olive Garden. It says, initial report showed an increase in dollars spent per order and an average drop in 10 minutes in time spent by customers at a table. They are also saying that they had over 85% utilization. It says, though 85% of the customers are using Ziosk, by no means has Olive Garden made it mandatory. That means that Olive Garden didn't push them to use that pay at the table solution. The restaurants chose, 85% of the patrons that came to that restaurant chose to use that pay at the table solution. It's actually much higher now, post COVID, we're looking around 92%. Take a look at some of the recent articles from Ziosk that also say a higher utilization post COVID. Now, let's do some math, okay? We have an average of 35 tables per location, and we see an average of 85% utilization, just like we found in the article. That means that 35 tables, 85%, 30 tables. 10 minutes reduced per table, okay? Now, 30 tables times 10 minutes is 300 minutes, okay? But you're not just moving one party through one table in one night 300 minutes total time savings. You're moving roughly six to eight parties that sit at each table each night, okay? So you have to multiply now this 300 minutes and you get between 1,800 minutes to 2,400 minutes saved for just one restaurant in one night, okay? That's a massive savings for a restaurant. Now we take a look at this. You can divide the number of minutes you have by let's say 30, 40 minutes, which it takes to seat another guest, and you multiply that by the average check a restaurant makes. In this case, we're looking at $374,000 that that one restaurant location made in one year when you look at maybe a Friday and a Saturday night, so let's just pick two busy nights a week, okay, that you're getting multiplied out by those 52 weeks. So again, $374,000 for one location but when you look at all 800 locations, that's close to $300 million that Olive Garden made in their first year by spending a little bit of money to get that bang for their buck. Not the whole $100 million. Zios raised $100 million. They didn't spend $100 million to buy those tablets. Remember that. Is that where they get all their money? No, it's not. Take a look. There are several types of customers that these restaurants now draw to that location. Okay, There's one. There is the employee on lunch break. When an employee goes to lunch, they have an hour to get back to work. That means that if you can move them through 10 minutes faster, they're gonna to go to you. Cause that 10 minutes is really important. Remember they gotta to drive to your restaurant and they gotta drive back. That 10 minutes is deal breaker on whether they eat full service, they go eat Chipotle or Subway or somewhere quick and grab. Now the event goer, the event goer is a big one. If your restaurant is on the way to a stadium, into a concert hall, into a movie theater or some sort of event, it's convenient on the way to that event. However, they didn't come to that restaurant or your restaurant to just eat there. They came to eat and they're going to another main event after the fact. 10 minutes can be a big deal breaker for those guys. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm sure you've been stuck at a restaurant before where you may be waiting longer than 10 minutes. Maybe it's 30 minutes or 40 minutes where you have to wait for the check and you're not so happy. So when you have that pay at the table solution, it comes to the top of the mind as a good place to eat when you gotta move in, move out. Because they remember, they don't remember the technology, they remember that when you were, they were there, you took good care of them, you got them served quick, and they were able to leave when they wanted. 
your servers are also going to see an uptick in tips that they make at your location. Because remember, they're not spending time anymore running checks back and forth. Now, they're looking at food and beverage, and they're seeing an average of an hour saved each shift because they're not running those checks back and forth anymore. That means they're going to make more tips at your location. They're going to serve about six to eight guests. Each server is going to serve about six to eight guests additional that they wouldn't have served if you didn't have this technology. They're going to make more tips. Do you think they're going to want to stick at your restaurant when they're making more tips? We can estimate that each location is making an extra $800,000 per year simply by having a pay at the table solution like Zios. Why? We saw it in the math. They're saving time, they're drawing in more guests on a regular basis throughout the whole year. $800,000 is really a conservative number when you look at the impact it makes to your business, okay? $800,000 per location, this is estimated numbers, Olive Garden didn't disclose this, however when you multiply this out over their 800 locations, you're looking at almost $700 million that Olive Garden benefited from having a technology like this in the first year. Let's just say it's $500 million, right? They're making their money, trust me. When it comes to pay the table, that convenience factor allows you to serve more guests and it draws different types of guests you wouldn't otherwise be able to receive by having this technology. Okay. You no longer have to spend the crazy amount of money like you do to have roll out tablets at each location. Now, there are plenty of options like Tabby where you can use a QR code. Scanning the QR code, you don't need to download an app as a customer. It pulls it up straight on an internet browser and it has your check. Why? Because it's a smart QR code that knows what restaurant and what table you're sitting at, just like a Zios tablet, but the customer owns the hardware and runs the hardware. What choice of pay at the table are you going to choose for your restaurant and when are you going to start to adopt the savings and the winnings that these are bringing to restaurants today?